Hold on for what y'all. He trying to show y'all his new glasses. Ooh, Lord, I ain't got on no necklace today. My, my real necklace. I'm looking all naked. What? Naked? <laughs> Look at his glasses, y'all. <laughs> you can't tell him he ain't clean. He think he the bomb. What is? What is hippie self? He's so hippie. And the, and the thing about it is, he wasn't hippie till he met me. Not, see, but I met claim, him. Okay. Really? 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 <laughs> really? And you just told me a story that when we first met, you thought I had a whole lot going on. When I first met him, y'all, he was short haircut, button down shirts. Old man sniper hats. Old man sniper hats. Just, hat. just as straight. Didn't wear no jewelry. The boy barely had a watch. Just as clean cut. No tattoos. No piercings. Nothing. He get with me. And, and just change up. He didn't got tattoos. He didn't got piercings he didn't grow his dreads out i know his parents like he met that girl and just went crazy they ain't wearing the hippie glasses you can't tell him nothing in them damn hippie shades say something back because i ain't got nothing to talk about i was talking to that guy i thought he was going to go a little bit ahead of me but i guess not so i let him go just driving etiquette that's that's all that was. He's but, such a nice driver because he oh. don't cuss people out. He don't have road rage or nothing. Unlike me when I was driving. Ooh, you should have seen her. She has she has passenger road rage. <laughs> okay, this was only one time. And these people deserve. They deserve to get cussed out for what they did. We in the parking lot. What, was we coming we in the coming, parking lot? No, we were we were leaving. We, we were, were leaving, leaving the parking lot. It's a big like a, what was it, strip mall? Yeah. And we were coming out and we were in the right of way coming down and I guess it was an older couple that were coming out of I don't know, Starbucks or someplace they were coming out of. But the as I'm driving the old man he kind of pulls up ahead of me and causes me to kind of slam I mean I mean you're in a parking lot so how fast are you going about 15 miles an hour but I kind of slam on the brakes because here he comes barreling out and he didn't look and so he had that look like oh shit and babe over here turns at him and she's like slow that car down motherfucker this is a parking lot this ain't no race again I ought to come out there and beat you and I mean she was just going the hell off at that minute, and he had that look like, I'm so sorry, yo, please help me. But she was like, you lucky I'm in this car, in this door here, because I come out there and beat your ass. <laughs> she was going off, and I'm like, hey, I was calm not down. doing all that. <laughs> he is lying his on wife, me. His wife was sitting there, and although you couldn't hear what they were saying in the car, but you get that feeling that she was like, Hero, Hero, just drive away. Soleil, drive away. Don't let her get out the car. <laughs> she but, had this seriously ooh, panicked ooh, look on her face, like, make sure the daughters are locked, Hero. <laughs> I was I wasn't that bad though. She was. She was hot. He always when she I no hot. when I do something, he always put it on extra thick. <laughs> if I say one curse word, he ain't you in the wrong lane? I'm going down limits. Oh. If I say one one curse word, he put it on extra thick. Like I done cut somebody out, slash they throw. You did. You were going off on them. You were like, you, you, you. I mean, because you had a whole dialogue. Now, this whole thing took about what? Two seconds at the most. And in that two seconds, she managed to get out three motherfuckers, a couple of bitches, 
I'ma strangle you and kill your children. I mean, she was going way off. I was like, babe. <laughs> you know, He's such a liar. He's such a liar. Just calm down. Every <laughs> situation's under control. Let me drive all people. But wait a minute. Wait a minute, though. But he the main one want to see me act a fool if something happened. Oh, let me go see this. That's a, yeah, that's about to be. This about to be a good one. Let me take a seat because you about to go okay. off. Okay, now if you notice her, what she's wearing now, she's wearing her all white. And usually when she wears her all white, there's usually a lot of religious undertones in it because she's a spiritual woman. Now, she's been having some, some situations at a certain office, and this is her second time going back to that office to handle some things that should have been handled like, what, a couple of weeks, a month ago, or something like that. And she's been getting the runaround, and she hasn't been treated like she feels she needed to be treated. So, this particular time, she said, babe, I gotta go back. So, I come back, and I'm getting ready to pick her up. We're getting ready to go. She's dressed in all white, and I'm like, Oh, it's about to be on now. Because, <laughs> well, I mean, she's going there. And she's serious. She's like, I'm going to talk to the supervisor. I'm going to get this stuff done. And I'm going, she's dressed in all white. Oh, she's probably going to put a monkey's foot in there and got her some juju beans and some, some voodoo powder, some rum. And she's just going to come in there like, oh, yeah, somebody's going to have some problems later on. <laughs> but See, I ain't think about me. <laughs> That's the way we have fun. We have fun. He's crazy for real. And he say I'm the crazy one. I ain't going there bothering the people. But, okay, now she went in. I said, well, babe, how'd it go? She said, oh, everything's fine now. She's all calm and collected. Everything's fine. Ain't nothing to watch. Now, somebody's not going to have a really wonderful Christmas this year. That's what I know. It's a bad time to be working in the office. No, because yesterday was not cute. And I figured I better put on some white to try to calm me down. Because yesterday, uh, I had went to the same place and the lady got on my nerves. And I just, I, for some reason, I just couldn't control myself. And before I realized it, I just cussed the woman out, snatched my purse, almost turned the chair over and walked out. It, it was ugly. It was Maybe that's should have taken it. Uh, probably not. And we got a long way to go. Okay, I gotta go because um, we're running in the traffic. We running in the traffic and my arm getting tired. Peace! And we weren't talking about nothing no way for seven minutes. Bye y'all. <laughs>